But now let's tell you about my next guest this morning. In the last 12 months, he's gone from laying bricks to laying down tracks. A father of three, former builder Michael Armstrong, picked by chance to audition for, guess what, American Idol whilst he was on holiday, holiday in Florida. And Michael is here in the studio. And it went really well for American Idol, didn't it? It did go very well, yes. I was actually on holiday in America with my family and we come across the uh, American Idol experience and my children were very keen for me to go in for it knowing my history of singing. And I entered thinking it was just going to be uh, a photo photographing or like a karaoke example. Yeah. And uh, I actually ended up uh, winning my heat and going on to singing at the final in front of a live uh, uh, theatre audience and winning the competition. You can hopefully on my singing merits and not on my dress sense. Oh <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so I, I was on holiday, so yeah, that, that proves look, it. You look like an Englishman abroad. <laughs> it's that's, the skinny legs. But, yeah. but that's all right. So of course, I mean, for that means you're put forward to the TV show, but you're not American. I wasn't able to do it because I don't have uh, American citizenship. I was literally just there on holiday, so... Uh, I mean, what a real blow to your chances. So you, you're back in the UK, you're back on the building site, no. and you get an amazing lucky break. I do. Literally a week or so after being back from America, uh, we were working in a beautiful house in Surrey, doing up uh, a couple's kitchen. And uh, I noticed around the house there were photographs of the lady of the house, uh, Lisa, of her posing with Michael Jackson, right. uh, Cliff Richards, <laughs> the Bee Gees... And I, I figured she was either in the music business or a serial groupie. You know. right. Either way, it was worth getting to know her better. So uh, I took her a, a CD of the track, some of the songs I've recorded over the years at home. And the very next day, her and her husband came to me and said that they really loved them and that we had something special there, and, and here I am. Well, something special, that's what they say. Let's make up our own mind. <laughs> So, from all of that, you know, you've got your EP out, or going to be out next month. It's out on the 9th of July, yes, all the details can be found on the website, all the w's.michaelarmstrongmusic.co.uk. So this is it, and you've been landed this great opportunity, I guess you, you'd be mad just not to pursue it to the nth degree. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I mean, that the video that you're seeing in the back there is actually filmed on one of my building sites. That's a house in Chelsea that we're about to start refurbishing. And that song, the, the lead song, Pay the Shade of Blue, I wrote when all this started happening about a year ago. And the song uh, kind of purposely refers to the life as a builder. Uh, the opening line is Sweet Gardenia, and Gardenia is a, a paint that all the builders use. Right. <laughs> so what's it like on, on your building site now? Are you the one that can be easily spotted for singing out the loudest? Uh, well, I always sang along to the radio. We've actually, in, in the last month or so, had a couple of instances of young ladies tracking me down on the uh, building oh, site, wow. which is very flattering, and the guys on the site love it. I'm not sure my wife's so keen, but uh, <laughs> that's, that's, been, that's been good fun. Well, let's hope this is the start of a great new musical career. Michael, we wish you all the very best. Great to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Stay with us here on Sunrise. Coming up, you can...